everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and I'm here with your card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you, leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy a really positive week. I'll be using my teacup tarot deck and later on, I will clarify with my time to shine deck. So Leo, let's have a look at your cards for this week, starting the 14th of November. And from the teacup tarot deck, your overall energy is the eight of coins. This card says, pay attention to the small details. Read the small print twice. And here our angel on the card, look, she's putting those final tiny little details on the cakes, small details, big difference. So mindfulness for you this week, small details are important. Read everything twice, cross the T's, dot the I's. Your help or your hurdle, we've got the Ace of Teacups. Now the Aces are all about new beginnings and the Ace of Teacups is about lovely new emotions coming in to find you. So this could be love, joy, positivity. Sometimes it can mean a new home. Generally, it's lovely, positive emotions of happiness and joy coming in to find you. Your guidance here, we've got card 19, the sun, one of the best cards in the deck. This is you reaping the rewards of the hard work. This is your harvest coming in. Here's the success you've been waiting for. And it also reminds you to start acting on those brilliant new ideas. Your help or your hurdle. No, we've done that. It's how can we help ourselves? The Ten of Pencils steps in here. The Ten of Pencils says expect the situation to improve. The Ten of Pencils says, look, every time you take a step up the ladder, things are getting better even better and so much better. Good news here. This is you climbing the ladder of success. Pulling it all together. We've just been talking about the word success and here it is on this card. Look, we've got the eight of teacups. Now this card here, she's just poised at the edge. She's hesitating. She can see success, that's where she wants to go, but she has to get across the water in order to get there. And all she has to do is step onto the first stepping stone and the next is right in front of her and so on. So this card says, take small steps. We've got the steps on the ladder, we've got the stepping stones on this card here. It doesn't always have to be a giant leap. Small, manageable, consistent steps will get you where you need to go to the success that you are seeking, one step at a time. And the Three of Pencils says, time to rest and relax, take some time out, talk things over with friends or loved ones, enjoy a quality little cup of tea. It's very much a healing card. And it says, expect the situation to improve. We're talking about that here. And then it's time for you to move on. So looking at the teacup tarot cards, just to summarise, paying attention to the small details is key. Happiness, joy and love. Positive new emotions coming in to find you. Here's the success. Here's you reaping the rewards of your hard work. And it also says, act on those brilliant new ideas. The situation's improving. Take things one step at a time. Be ready to rest, relax, and then move on towards success. So let's just clarify with the time to shine deck. The six of action, that's lovely. That's the victory card. Time for you to enjoy the results of your hard work. We're saying that here. This is the card of victory and success. The eight of life, we've got a double message here. It's the eight of coins in the tarot. This is about learning new skills, but principally 
a double message on pay attention to the small details. The Four of Action says, it's time to express gratitude, happiness, contentment and joy. This is you being recognised for everything you are and all that you do. And this card asks you, receive with grace and gratitude. This is a card of celebration. It's absolutely lovely. The four of life comes in next. We've got two fours going on here. And this says, just when you're making your decisions, when you're looking at all the small print very, very carefully, consider situations of too much and too little and strike a balance between the two. Look, she's got a teacup that's far too big and a teacup that's far too small. She needs a medium-sized one. So with this, this asks you to be mindful. Work-life balance needs to be considered. Financial balance needs to be considered as well. Are your finances balanced? Look into the small print. Get everything sorted. The Eight of Wisdom says when you're moving forward, follow your moral compass. Let honesty, integrity and fairness guide you. And as they do, the path will be clear for you. Focus on those lovely qualities and make good and sound decisions based on those. And the final card, the four of emotions says, stand back, pay attention and look for wonderful opportunities coming your way. Don't be too focused in one direction. You need to look at the whole picture. Do what our angel's done here, look. She's got a pair of binoculars. She's standing back and here is the news and even better news fluttering down towards her. She can see it when she stands back. So that again, that's key mindfulness for you this week. So just to summarise, the double message, pay attention to the small detail that is stressed for you. Reaping the rewards of your harvest, this is success and recognition coming in for you. Expect things to get better and take these steps towards success one step at a time. The situation is improving and the victory and the success is right here for you. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, click that subscribe button. It's fantastic when you do. And then you'll get notified when I do the next one for you. So take care now and I'll see you soon.